Hi, today I'm going to teach you the personal pronoun. Personal pronouns are words that replace the name of a person. For example, John is busy. I can replace John with a personal pronoun. I can say, he is busy. He is an example of a personal pronoun. Personal pronouns can be used as subjects in the sentence. You will have to remember the personal pronouns that can be used as subjects. The personal pronouns that can be used as subjects are I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they. I, you, he, she, it are singular personal pronouns. You know what singular means, don't you? Singular is like the word single and means one. So, I is just one person. We, you, they are plural personal pronouns. Plural means more than one. You knew that, right? Did you see that you can be singular and plural? If you want to, to use these personal pronouns in a sentence, they have to be the subject of the sentence. For instance, I live here. I is a personal pronoun used as a subject. Another example, you speak perfect English. You is a personal pronoun used as a subject. Personal pronouns can also be used as objects. The personal pronouns that can be used as objects are different from those that can be used as subjects. Again, you will have to remember these. The personal pronouns that can be used as objects are me, you, him, her, it, us, them. Me, you, him, her, and it are the singular personal pronouns. Us and them are plural personal pronouns. If you want to use these personal pronouns in a sentence, they have to be the object of the sentence. For example, she helps him every day. She is the subject. Him is the object of this sentence. That is why she is the personal pronoun in subject form and him is the personal pronoun in object form. Another example. We visit her every Saturday. Her is the object form of the personal pronoun because it is the object of the sentence. Helpful. And now it's time for your exercises.